2019. Let's continue your prayer for Sister D. Shelton, Sister Pete Gary, Sister Helen Harrison. I lift up in prayer Deacon Wilford Simon and family, Brother Elam and family, Sister Powell and family, Sister Barbara Vine and family, Sister Linda Brockson, Sister Marie Black, the Lee family, Sister Jackie Lee and her family, Sister Lynn Taylor and family, Sister Barbara Horney and family, Sister Ellen Eastwood and family, Brother Quint Jones Jr. and family, Brother Jerry Eskridge and family, Brother Kevin Casey and family, Sister Cynthia Armstead and family, Sister Princess Watkins and family, special prayer for William Simon, Willie Johnson, Ms. Lakeisha Hardy and her family, Judith Mary, Harold Taylor, Marlon Lee, Willie Eason, Cameron Eason, the Salome family, Samantha Eason, Sister M.A. Hardy, Reverend Rufus and Linda Wheat, Ms. Thelma Mitchell, Regina Miles, the Torres family, the Cartwright family, Ken Thow, the Davenport family, Rebecca Johnson, Valerie Jones, Crystal Gillum, Ann Banks, Rhonda Jacobs, Michael Templeton, Lorraine Jones, Ken Thou, Diane Mitchell, Robert Nuez, Alana Sierras, Tina Bannon, Colorado Sotos, Regina Lopez and two grandsons, Lorenzo and Jefferson, Harley Dye, Guadalupe Bannon, Linda Mitchell, Kawana Winfrey Windsor, Eldridge Marti, and Reverend Allen and family. Special prayer for Reverend Ryan's daughter, Tracy. She's having eye surgery. Special prayer for the American Baptist Progressive State Sunday School and Baptist Training Union Congress of Texas, Union Baptist District Association of Texas, and American Baptist Progressive State Convention of Texas. Special prayer for the Open Door Mission. We continue to pray for our youth, our loved ones behind prison bars, our loved ones in the military overseas in a foreign land. Special prayer for the mayor, all the city officials of the city of Houston, the police officers in all the states, the mayors of all the states, the governors of all the states, and the president of the United States of America. Anybody else in that like that to the prayer list? Yes. Um, shall we spend that? Satisfies them out with good yes, things, so that thy youth is renewed like the eagles. Mm -hmm. The Lord executed righteousness and judgment yes, for all that are oppressed. He made known his ways to Moses, yes. his acts unto the children yes, of Lord. Israel. Yes, Lord. In thee, O Lord, Lord. do put my trust. my trust. Let me never be put to confusion. Yes, Deliver me yes. in thy righteousness yes, and cause me to escape. Yes, Incline their ear unto me yes. and save me. 
Yes. These are my strong invitations. Yes. Where would you want me to continue yes. to resort? Thank you. given commandment. Thank you, Father. Save me. Thank you, Without my rock yes. and my fortress. Yes. Deliver me, yes, sir. oh yes, my sir. God, out of the hand of the wicked, yes. the yes. hand of the unrighteous, yes, and the cruel man. Yes. For thou art my hope, yes, oh Lord God. Lord. Uh, my trust from my youth. Yes. By thee have I been holding up from the womb. Yes, they are he that took me out of my mother's yes, bones. My praise, my praise shall be continually yes, yes. I was a wonder yes. under many yes. without my strong refuge. Yes, Let my mouth be filled with thy praise yes. and with thy honor all the day. Yes. Cast me down all the Lord. time of yes, sir. Save me not yes, from my strength. Lord. It will be revelation of you pray talk to Lord all the Let us pray. Yes. Our gracious Father, yes. we come once again. Yes. Father, gather in your house of prayer. Yes. Father God, we come just to say thank you. Thank you. God, realize that you're the creator yes. and maker of yes. all mankind. Yes. God, realize that it's you who stood on our bedside. Yes. 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 Thank you. Watch over, Lord. God, you kept us out of prayer. Thank you. Thank you. Thank God, just for that, we yes, say Lord. thank you. Thank you. And Lord, we can realize that you woke us up early yes, this morning. Yes. Thank you, sir. Brand new day. Thank you. God, they that yes. our eyes can never see. Lord, yes. And God, we just stop by and say thank you. Yes. Thank you. God, you've been such a merciful God. Yes, yes. You've been such a kind God. Yes. You've been such a God of love yes. and understanding. Yes. Yes. You've been a God of forgiveness. Yes, yes. And yes. we stop by and say yes, thank, thank you. Thank you. Lord, we come now. Yes. Lord, somebody is sick on sick bed. Yes. Yes. Oh, Lord, somebody is grieved. Yes. Oh, Lord, somebody you know, is confined. Yes. Oh, Lord, but you know all names. Oh, name. Lord. And Lord, I know we have to hear power in yes. your hands. Yes. Oh, Lord, if it's your will today, yes. Yes. pray to touch will. right now. Yes, oh, Lord, we just want to say thank you. Thank you, thank you for this church, Lord. Yes, Lord thank you for the shepherd, Lord. Yes. Yes. Oh, Lord, we thank you for the members, Lord. Yes. Oh, Lord, we thank you for the youth, Lord. Yes. Yes. Please, Lord, have mercy. Yes.
the Je know ye that Jehovah he is God. Yes. It is he that hath made us and we are his yes, well, well, well. we Thank you. are his. We are his people and the sheep of his pasture. Mm -hmm. Enter into the gates with thanksgiving and into his courts with praise. Give thanks unto him and bless his name. For Jehovah is good, his loving kindness endures forever. Yes. His faithfulness unto all generations. I've just read Psalms 100 and it's time. Amen. Amen. Just because she knows street 
That's not official. Mm -hmm. Let God lead you and guide you, young man. If you want to yeah. be a baller, Amen. That. Listen, if somebody trying to tell you right, uh -huh. listen to them. Amen. Listen to them. Amen. Young man, Amen. we asking God for some blessings in your life too. Amen. That you would be the young man God has called you to be. Whatever your desire is, I'm not sure of what your desire is. I don't know your desire. But I ask God that he'd keep your mind and your, and your heart stayed on him. And that your schooling would be right. If nothing else, I know that. As a parent, that you'd be right with your school. We pray that all of y'all be right with y'all school. God first. You put God first, you get you right with your school. That your school is right. Get your school right. That's the most important thing in school. Because without education, you're doomed. You're doomed. And you're almost done with just a high school education in this day and age. You need a little bit more, young people. A little bit more. We encourage y'all to stay on the right path. To give it all that you got. To do the best that you can do. If you do the best, God will do the rest. Give it your best. And we're proud of y'all. We're so grateful for the Casey family coming in. With more you. We're grateful to you guys. We thank God for you guys. Thank God for Brother Casey and Sister Casey. We thank God for Sister Jane. Bless you, bless you. In the midst of her sickness, she don't always make it out. But them kids come on out. Yeah. We thank God for her when she comes out. Even when she's not feeling the greatest, she'll come on and sometimes she say, I'm not feeling my greatest. Sometimes she try to grin and bear and say, oh, okay. But you can see the pain. Well, Sister Jackie, we ask that God for a miraculous blessing. John wrote in first John. He said, Brother, I wish the above all that you would prosper. Not just the money thing, y'all. Yes, 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 right. That's right. But your health. Right. Because money ain't nothing if your health ain't right. right. Yeah. We believe in God this year, church. We believe in God this year for miraculous healing for her. Yeah. But God created it. Yes, yes. And we believe in God for miraculous healing this year, this day forward for your body, for your body. That the suffering, the swelling, the fluid, that all of that is fixed in Jesus' name. Because if Jesus can't do it, nobody can. We believe in that. Because when you don't feel well, you, you're no help to nobody else. Because you're no help to yourself. That's why we believe in God for your healing. For you to rise up above that. For them to see what's happening with you. Because something's not right. But we ask in God. For God to reveal the next time you go to work. That God will reveal to them what's happening with your body. We're believing that this year for you. We're believing on next year when the youth any day come around, their mom is not looking how she looks today. I believe that in Jesus' name. And I believe on your behalf. I stand in the gap with you this morning, sister. I believe that. And I heard on yesterday a lady says, if you got Jesus, you got all you need. If you got Jesus, you got all you need. And if he decides not to, he says, you'll become my testimony. It ain't because it can't. Because there's nothing too hard for God. There's nothing God can't. There's nothing that God can't do. Nothing. You, you're our future. Yeah, yeah. Be the young people God is calling you to be. Don't get caught up with peer pressure. Listen, 
That should be nothing that you can't talk to your parents about. Nothing. Nothing. I had all boys. I didn't have no husband. And I got my divorce. I was single. But it wasn't nothing my boys couldn't tell me. I don't care what it was from the prophets to whatever. They had to tell me. I was the all in all. They had to tell me. Listen. You tell your parents. Whatever it is, it's nothing too great that you can't tell your parents. I just read out online where a 12-year-old killed herself last night. Oh, no. And all that Called at midnight and got an Uber. And the Uber took her to a nine-story building and she jumped off the building and killed herself. Nine-story garage. And she jumped off the building and killed herself. And she had already left a note at home saying, that's the point, I'm at the point of no return. What is on a 12 year old's mind that you can't tell your, I don't care what it is, you better run and tell your parent. Don't you let no stranger bully you and tell you you better not tell your parents this will happen or that will happen or what they're going to do. You better run and tell them. You better run and tell them. Run to your parents. 12 year old, you ain't got nothing to do but go to school. That's right. You ain't got to pay no bills or nothing. That's right. That should be nothing that you can't discuss with your parents. That's right. Don't let nobody make you think that it, it, it is, because it's not. Amen. Because if I, my mother was alive, that would be nothing that I couldn't discuss with her. All right. I want to encourage you, youth, to keep Jesus in your mind. Yeah. Don't let your mind get mixed up. Don't let nobody mess your mind up. A mind's a terrible thing to waste. Yeah. Y'all know what I'm talking about because you see it all the time. You see people with their mind wasted. God made you. He made you to be somebody. He made you. He made all of us to worship him. You Listen to your parents. Be obedient yeah. that your days may be longer upon the land which the Lord thy God has given. We love you, youth. We love you. She's not feeling well this morning, so I'm just going to take it back to her. It's been a year for her to give her own arms. <laughs> To Dr. Landry, to my recent love, to you, my brothers and sisters in Christ. Sister Landry did an awesome job. Yeah. And I just want to say, um, on behalf of the Junior Church Matron, thanks again. I know I told some of the parents the other night. Thanks for sharing your youth with us. Amen. Thanks for allowing them to come out here, even when I'm not out here. Amen. And thanks. I, I do want to send a special thanks to Sister Casey. She has stepped in, and when I'm not here, they sign everybody in, they're taking up money, they're doing the same things that we've been doing in the past years, and we really appreciate that. I wasn't here, but I know about it, I hear about it. So it's not going unknown the work that y'all are doing. Amen. We appreciate y'all and we thank y'all. Yeah. For the grandparents Amen. that's there for us, no matter what. This past week, I just need to tell my mom in front of everybody, thank you. I love you. Amen. A.B. All y'all, thank y'all. Because whenever I called and I needed any of y'all, y'all was there for me. And I had been sick in Sister Landry. It was time that I would tell her I'm going to do something. And she's like, oh, no, sister, I'm going to get out. I'm going to do it. I'm out. Sister Landry, thanks for all that you do because she do. Y'all, this lady, she went in here the other day when I said she's strong. She's a strong woman. I'm not the only one that go through this. I'm not the only one that's sick. There's other people that are sick. And Sister Landry fight battles just as well as I do. But she's strong, and she fights, and she makes sure that we're on top of what we need to be on top of. And I thank everybody. Um, and we call her Aunt Chubb, Sister Amen. Amen. Thank you. 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 Thank you.
you go to a God, open the Bible. I was taught years ago, if you don't know what's going on in your life and you're confused, just open up the Bible in the first chapter you come to read it. And you keep on reading it. Don't stop reading until you get an understanding of that. And if you still not got that help, call Reverend Landry. Reverend Landry is your next go-to person. Call your parents. So y'all just keep that in mind and know that. And three weeks ago today, Reverend Landry asked y'all, you, to read Psalms over the summer. I hope y'all still doing that because I've been talking to y'all about it. I love everybody and I thank everybody and I love y'all. You keep your head up.
the money the, that you donate for the youth to go to New Orleans on week after next. Thank you. Amen. God bless you, God. I want to let you know that I really want to tell you thank you. This past week, uh, we had the American Baptist Progressive State Sunday School and Baptist Training Union Congress of Texas here. Amen. Amen. And I just want to tell you thank you Amen. Amen. for the work that you've done, uh, from the musical. Uh, I thank you for participating. Uh, I thank you for the labor that you invested. I thank you for the time, your finances. I thank you for taking time out to actually come and support the program, uh, sit in all the classes, uh, learn, and, and not only that, but support all the way through the whole night. It was a, great success and would not have been a success without your participation. I'll let you know thank you very much. Yeah. I know that anytime you put something to that endeavor, uh, we fed every night. Uh, that was so special to where uh, they're still sitting back and say, well, we had just a great time. The president, uh, Dr. Thomas said it was one of the best uh, sessions we've had and the moderator Stephen said we had a great time. And I just want to let you know thank you. Mm -hmm. I can't pay you, but I can tell you thank you. Right. And God is pleased with the real spiritual. Uh, it was educational and all that. People got something out of it. Yeah. You got something out of it. And we thank Brother Casey for putting out there on our Facebook Live. Amen. There are people Amen. that were able to see Oak Hill Baptist Church from a different place to come in and fellowship with us and, and really just come in. Uh, I, just, I just want to let you know that's a dynamic thing that God's did something. And I just want to let you know I really appreciate uh, your commitment to it and giving God the praise. I'm going to let you know the Lord is pleased with you. Thank Amen. you so very much. Amen. footsteps in the church. Yeah. You're the old folks, but you don't see the children. Mm. Y'all the future. Yeah. One thing about it, if you don't put it in on the young, you can't go in. Yeah. They need to understand that we feel God and raise up and you know that it's important to have God in your life. Sure, because when trouble comes, you'll have a back door. You'll have a way out. And the most important thing, I want to applaud the parents and grandparents for thank you, yeah. for thanking up for loving your children enough to waking them up when they grumbling like Buffalo Grub and don't want to come in Get out of here. Yeah. But if you think enough of your child to bring them to God, God gave you the gift of them, and you bring them to where God wants you to be able to train them. So the Proverbs 22 and 6 say, train up a child in the way you should go. But the bottom line is, you ain't got to teach a child to pick a rock up and throw it in the window. Come on. You got to teach them not to do it. Yeah. Um, I just wanted to let everybody know that after church, um, refreshments will be served for the entire church. So that everybody can come back and sit with the youth and eat. We don't have any games to play today, but y'all can just come after church and eat. I don't think y'all heard that. Y'all got one. 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 We got a bit tonight. He ain't your man. How you doing? He's man of his word. So we appreciate you coming out this way. All for now. What we do around here, uh, Brother Will, can I get you to read the banner for us, please?
and being willing to save his little pennies yes. to send down to go to your house. Now, Father, if you don't mind, give him a hundredfold increase. Yes. Touch his little mind in his heart. And all that watch over protection, gracious yes, master. Lord. And since he's a blessing, let it be a blessing inside of his home. Yes. Touch his family, gracious yes. master. Yes, let it be a beacon of light in that home. And let him touch, gracious master, if you don't mind, in a mighty way. But if you don't mind, bless that young child. Yeah. I'm thinking about old kill. And we'll be so careful to give you the praise. In Jesus' master's name we pray. Amen. 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 What we do is fill this thing up. And I'm not going to up. Let's go right up, you guys. Y'all be rolling up. We're not going to work. It's just this. Yeah. 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 As soon as they learn that, they understand where their help comes from. All their resources come from. Mm -hmm. We thank God for our youth that come this way. They all get an outstanding job on the singing and the uh, Monday night and also Thursday night. I want to thank you all for the ones that did join in with the group of choir and song. I take a moment for that We thank you so very much for helping to make us some sense. Thank you for your willingness to participate.
Amen. Thank you for your giving.
Preacher. Preach the word. Preach the word. Preacher. Preach the word. Preach the word. Preacher. Preach the word. Talk to God this morning. All right. 
and ask a question. God, I, I, I know what your word says. All right. Serve the Lord with gladness. In other words, give him praise, worship him yes. with gladness. We should have a cheerful heart. All right. I get that. I understand yes. that. Yes. Mm -hmm. But the question comes to mind, God, how can I serve you with gladness when I have despair All right. in my heart? All right. Yeah. God, how can I serve you when I have failed my test scores? All right. How can I be cheerful and worship you when uh, I'm not moving up to the next grade? I'm supposed to go into high school, but they are holding me back another year. How can I Lord, serve the Lord yes. with gladness? Yes. Yes. God is all right. Yes. 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 Then I, I look at how can I serve the Lord huh? with gladness when I'm at the grave site and I'm right. hearing the preacher say ashes to ashes, right. dust Lord. to dust. Right. But I must wish you yeah. serve the Lord yeah. with gladness. Yeah. Come on, man. I, I, I'm to serve the Lord with gladness when there's sickness all in my body yeah. And I put two niggas together, still cannot come up with 10 cents. Oh, yeah. How, how, how? Oh, Lord, yes, sir. Amen, amen. Yes, Lord. Amen. Can I serve the Lord? Yes. With gladness. Yes. How can I worship yeah. the Lord yeah. with gladness? Yes. I'm supposed to be able to come before his presence with, 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 with singing, Dr. Landry. Yes, sir. Yes, I'm supposed to be cheerful, jubilant, yes. mm -hmm. praising his yes, holy name. Yes, 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 but tears are rolling on the inside. Oh, yes. Heart is aching on the inside. Yes. You see the outside. You see the hallelujah, praise you, thank you, Jesus, but on the inside. Yes, when I walk out that door, my heart is crying with tears. Yes. And yes. Yes. 
Yeah. He said, weariness and painfulness and watching often in hunger. Yes, sir. Often Paul was thirsty. Often Paul yeah. was cold. Yeah. Yeah. He was naked yeah. in the coldness. Yes. yes. Suffer bitterness. Yes, sir. Oh. Oh, but Paul, Paul, Paul says, yes. Oh, the Philippians rejoice. Rejoice. Yes. In the Lord always. Always. And again, I say, huh? rejoice. Yes. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. But what I like about the Apostle Paul, he didn't just stop there. He said, Now, now not, not, not that I speak in respect of woe. Yes. He said, If I had to learn something. Yes, learn something. He said, If I have learned that whatsoever. Yeah. 
up and down life, dangerous highways. Father, only you know the future. Only you know what's going on, gracious master. But he's trusting you. He's believing that you can take care of his family. Up and down life, dangerous highways. We thank you in advance right now. We have a prayer answering God. We thank you right now, master, for giving us evidence that you can do what you said you can do. We thank you right now. We stand on your word because we believe what you said you can do. You can keep him, gracious master. You can protect him and his family up and down life, dangerous highways. We thank you as they go on vacation. We ask you to bless them there and back. And now they're going to enjoy themselves and come on back back home. Father, we thank you right now. So you can get the praise and you get the glory because you're an awesome God. You're an all-knowing God. You're an all-loving God. And because you love us so much, protect us like a mother hen. Got us under the feather. Thank you right now, precious master. Because he has enough faith to believe that you can do what you say you can do. We thank you right now because we know you're able, master. We know you're qualified. You did it before, Master, and you can do it again. Touch him right now, Master. Whatever it is that's a need, call him your will, Master. And we're going to be so careful to give you the praise. We're going to be so careful to give you the glory. That's the words of our mouth. In the meditation of our heart. Be acceptable in our sight. O Lord, our strength and our redeemer. It's in Jesus' name. Oh, it's in Christ Jesus' name. We pray. Brother, according to your faith, be it unto you. Give all the angels a praise this morning. We thank God for Reverend Reese, you know. Did you get a word this morning? When you come expecting, you God will meet you. God will give you an answer. I thank God for what he said. We're ready now for the last prayer tonight, I mean this morning, and we thank you for coming out. We thank you, and hopefully God has said something to meet you in your needs. And we thank you for our youth. Children, we want to ask God to continue to bless you and protect you. We're ready for the last prayer now. And now that we're while you're out of school, we want to make sure you stay out of harm's way. Be careful with the things, the eyes, what you see. Be careful with the feet where you go. Be careful with the mouth what you say. We actually protect you from down like dangerous highways. Because it's an awesome thing. You know that you and God protect you. Turn to this master. We thank you for this day and this hour. We thank you for selecting it from eternity past. And the each the war room chest, gracious method, the triune, you decided this day and this hour. You allow this annual day to happen. We thank you for our children, name by name, one by one. Touch them from the top of their head to the bottom of their feet. Touch their lives and little minds and little hearts. Give them strength and give them hope, gracious master. No matter what storm in this thing called life, everything will be all right. Let them hear what Sister Landry said, and they can talk to their parents about anything. Let them be able to open up, gracious master, communicate with their parents. And we thank you right now, master. If you don't mind, bless this little few mission band that you got here. Name by name, one by one. And then transition through this summer, gracious master. Keep arms away from them. Give them a warning spirit, gracious master, when danger comes their way. Watch over them, gracious master. We plead the blood over their little lives. And protect them, gracious master. That way they can be prepared to go back to school. And Master, we want to thank you for Reverend Reesino this morning. Yes. We thank you that touched Reverend Reesino yes. from the top of his head to the bottom of his feet. Yes. Put back inside him what he poured out for us, gracious Master. We thank you he gave us his best this morning. He gave us words of encouragement this morning. And he enlightened us, gracious Master, how to be give you praise in the midst of a storm. Yes. And we thank you right now. Everybody that's under my humble voice. If you don't mind, touch them, gracious master. Touch the need, whatever it is, according to your will, that you know that they need it. And we thank you so very much this morning because you're an awesome God. You're an awesome provider. You're a bridge over the of water. You're everything that we need. Now, master, we ask you to bless the preparer to the food in the back. Touch right now every preparer. We ask you for the food that's prepared for everybody that's going to eat. And if you don't mind, let it be done for the glory and honor of the kingdom. And gracious master, we're going to be so careful to give you the praise. We'll be so careful to give you the glory. Let the words of our mouth and the meditation of our heart be acceptable in thy sight. O oh Lord, our strength and our redeemer. It's in Jesus' name that we pray. The grace, mercy, and truth may the grace of our Lord and Savior and the sweet communion of the Holy Spirit 
Then the rest of the Bible is now until the saints come together again and they all said, God bless your heart. Sister Jack said, come meet him in the fellowship. God bless your heart.